welcome back to the vlogs okay so today i'm going out for dinner with tiffany and bella i'm meeting them in leicester square which is nice um i've literally been working all day <laughs> i've been working all day i feel just so haggard but i'm finally starting to feel a bit more like i'm starting to feel so like uh, can i get my words out please I'm finally starting to feel a bit more direction with like my career and stuff. Like I'm realizing I'm 25. Like don't get twisted, I love what I do, but I just, I don't know. I'm starting to feel a bit more direction. I'm try I wanna challenge myself this year. I wanna make more money. I want more money. I also just want a better life for myself. And unless I really like grow where I'm at, it's just not gonna happen, so. Oh, my contact lens is falling out my eye. And I lost it. Okay. Alison! Oh my god, yay. Just a few more weeks of this and then it's pow pow in my eyes. Pow pow! Yeah. <laughs> I'm basically going out today. And I kind of feel like January is like the month of reset. It's just the month of reset, like, it's just getting my things in line, getting my ducks in a row. Wait, oh, I think it goes. I just make sure everything makes sense. Um, I'll listen to the Receipts podcast, which is literally my favorite podcast to listen to. And I'm gonna just get ready, quickly. Let me put you somewhere where it makes sense. <laughs> if you could see how dirty this area was, you'd actually cost me. <laughs> mm, I could live in filth, it's embarrassing, actually. I just feel like I need a cleaner. Like I can't, cleaning just takes up so much of my time. And I feel like some days I'm like, okay, I'm gonna do a nice spender stating, a nice deep clean. And it just takes the whole of my life. And I just, I can't live like that basically. I love the refined brown gel. I don't know why Tiffany didn't like it. I just feel like it's so perfect. No complaints right here. Which we get ready all the time. So we're gonna just speed on right through this. Actually, no, we're not. I'm gonna just get real for a sec. So yeah, like I said, like I feel like January is just like the month that you kind of just set your goals and like everything that you kind of want to do in the year. And honestly, I have no real goals. I just have things that I want to achieve for myself and the kind of person I want to be by the end of this year. And it's just, I don't know, living a more authentic, authentic life, you feel me? Like just doing things that are just a bit more in line with who I am, like not forcing anything, like letting everything come naturally. Just putting out the energy I wish to receive, you feel me? Um, I'm gonna be 25 this year, oh my God. I just thought like I'd be somewhere else at the age of 25. I don't know why, I just thought I would be somewhere else, someone else, didn't think I was still be living at home. But like this morning, I was just sat on my toilet. <laughs> That's so, <laughs> such an image. Why did I give you that image? Um, no, this morning I was like sat on my toilet and just sort of talking to myself and I kind of realised that I'm so blessed and grateful for what I what I have around me, what I've been, what I have, what's the word? What I have, basically. I'm so grateful for what I have, like how many people can say that they have like their own little shack in their house which is just completely theirs and you know they can make it any way they want to they can dress it up dress it down they can just do what they like and just live a do you know what i mean like no many people have that luxury so i'm just learning to be like okay maybe just because you're not living on your own in your own flat and where you would like to be or living with like a cousin or a family member at this moment in time like what you have is so precious and you should be so thankful for it so um yeah, obviously I'm still shooting for the stars, but right now I'm, I think this is the year of like being content. Do you know what I mean? Ah, that's the word, the year of contention. I think that is the right word in the right context, but I don't know. Is contention like the full word for content? I think it is. I could be wrong though. Nusha! Hello. Hey baby, do you to the vlogs? I look cute. I don't know if they can Hello. see you. It's Nosa! Hey, honey. You okay? Um, what was I going to say? Okay. I 
Let me show you this. Let me turn this to you. You look very gorgeous. Thank you. I haven't even got makeup on. I love you. Have you not? Oh my god. No, I, I just fell out my brows. ready i was literally on the phone for about two hours two hours whilst i was getting ready but i really like how you have my makeup today um i did a new lip combo which was very 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 inexpensive i did the kiko just rubbed off 531 liner with the fenty uh, fenty glow lip thing <laughs> lip stuff and I used my Morphe Free Burn on top just to give it a more of like a nudie kind of colour. But I've been talking so much that it's kind of faded off. So that's a little annoying. Cool beans. Anyway, um, let me actually get dressed. I feel a bit, I don't know. Oh my god, I need to shave my legs. <laughs> Look what I got gifted. Um, hey, Esther had reached out and gifted me their thing <laughs> the shaving kit I have the whole thing so I think they gave me the uh, the holder comes in this little package this is fun oh this is cute oh it's heavy that's nice so anyway it comes with the holder so like a home for your razor like finally a home for your razor which is cute it came with the pink razor blade obviously i chose the color pink very on brand i love how weighty these are like when you see the instagram ads you think they're kind of flimsy but they're generally quite they're very well very well like made i can't explain it but yeah that's a little razor ignore my dry hands because i just washed them and what is this i want some extra razor heads which is very useful because i will be needing them so I'm going to store it in a dry place. So does that mean I can't keep it in the shower? Right, so it says recommend changing your blades after five to seven times of usage as well. So that's good. I don't actually shave often. I only shave like right now when my legs are hairy girl and I don't have the time to use those creamy things. I love those creams. I prefer it. I know they're really bad for you, but it's just, it works for me. Anyway, I'm gonna try that for the first time in the shower. And I'll let you know how it goes, but thank you, Hey Astrid. Thank you. Thank you, Astrid. Hey Astrid, Astrid, hey Astrid. I don't know, but thank you. I really appreciate it. And we're done. Yes, I showered with a full face of makeup on. Because sometimes I like to body shower. Back in the day, my friend Annie used to do this all the time. She'd get ready and then get in the shower. And then like the steam from the shower makes your makeup come out nicer. I don't know, girl, but I don't know. I don't think it does. But you know, sometimes I like to do it when I can't be bothered. So yes, that's me done. Guys, I'm not gonna lie, this razor is sick. It's sick. The thing is, I'm not one to like invest in razors. I feel like I normally just use those packets from like, this really shit packets that you get from like the drugstore, like pack 10, one and done, use it once, chuck it away. That is literally, what I was using before, but this is generally a really good shave. Like I shaved my both my legs, like my shave both my legs in like less than five minutes. Like it was so quick, it was smooth. I also used to like, because I would use like those really crappy razors, I would always cut myself sometimes. And that's kind of what put me off using razors for a lot because of I would cut myself. But with this one, I didn't do nothing. Like it really, it really was a good shave. I can't lie. Um, I think I have a discount code. If I do, I'll put it there, I think, I think. But I actually, I'm not even just saying this, just to say it. I genuinely think these razors are really, really good. Like, really, really good. The biggest struggle I'm facing right now is trying to figure out what shoes to wear with my outfit because, I don't know, in my mind, when I wore this dress, I envisioned it with gold heels. I didn't realize I didn't have any gold heels anymore. I kind of got rid of them, which is annoying. That's because they got a bit old. So, I haven't replaced them yet. So, I have to either go black, white, or... Yeah, those are the kind of really options we have. 
But anyway, let me pee and then I'll figure it out. Thank you, Loki. This is what I'm wearing tonight. Obviously, the, the same. I wear this jewelry all the time. I need to get more creative. Yes. This is my dress for tonight, which I really, really love. I'm gonna carry my handbag from Naked Wardrobe. Naked, just naked. Um, and these black heels, you can't see them, but they're black. I would show you guys a full outfit, but you know, no mirror. <laughs> Update on the wardrobe. So they got I got a call from the depot today and I think they're gonna be delivering it sometime this week and they've asked me if they need someone to install it as well. So hopefully if it's a good price, I'll ask them to install it themselves. But I already had someone that came in that originally was gonna do it and he just couldn't do it because I didn't have all the parts. But yeah, that's the wardrobe update. This is my outfit update. Um what do I need in my bag? Cool, let me get my lip stuff. Anyway, sorry guys, I was moisturising my legs and I could not get over how smooth they were thanks to the Hey Astro style. Oh, 10 out of 10, would strongly recommend. Anyway, the fragrance for today is my Oud Ispahan from Dior. Love it. I also sprayed some Kalina Herrera as well before I sprayed that on top. Just to give it some layers. You've got me. Layers. Yeah, that's me. I'm gonna go to Tiffany's house right now. She's just calling me and we're gonna get going. Hey! I just need someone to tell me to take my makeup off. Alright, take it off. Alright, I'll speak to you tomorrow. I'll speak to you tomorrow, babes. Love you. Let's get this makeup off. I am very drunk. I am very, very wave right now. Very wait. I decided that these braids are coming out this weekend. I feel like this is the last week. They've done their they've done their service. They have done their service. Where is my face cleanser? It's not in front of me. One second. And the messy. Follow my instruction. Look at this school. I'm not drunk, but I'm not sober. It's bad. You know. Right. Cleanser. So we're using the fresh, the fresh soy face. Soy face cleanser. That's a lot of products, but that's fine. I have gotten into the habit of not buying, um, of not buying like makeup wipes because I feel like when I buy makeup, I just become so lazy. But when I get like buy a cleanser that I just use for taking off my makeup, like a gel thing, it makes me proper commit to like taking off my makeup. So I then. I'm like, I have to take it off properly, otherwise I'm sleeping with it on and I just don't want to do that. So that's what I'd be doing. I'm still messy. Dun, 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 dun. I need like, oh my god, my sink is blocked. Oh my god. There's just so many things that are going wrong. I always forget I have these. Basically, I went to Primark a while back and I bought these facial cleansing pads. It are meant to be used for like when you want to remove your makeup. So you get these cleansing pads, right? And I always forget I have them. 
but they're actually quite good so there's three of them i don't know where the other two have gone but like you put them in the wash and obviously you wash them and they're reusable and then when you need to remove your makeup you put remover on it and you use it just to like help get in to get into the crevices and stuff me however i use it when i have my lashes in and i don't have the energy to remove makeup properly so i put a cleanser on this and then do what needs to be done but honestly today i can't believe why i had that so now it's kind of rendered useless but that's fine um if you want to clean your lashes without damaging them wanting to last long i recommend get i recommend getting a q-tip putting marcella water on it and then running the marcella water through the top i'm so drunk i forgot to put on my face down I genuinely forgot to put on my fake tan. I don't know who told me to get that cocktail at the end of the night. Oh my god, it was so strong. It finished me. Finished me. Jesus. I don't know, sometimes when I put on fake tan, I'm like, can you even tell? But girl, with this one, you can really tell. I use, I use the Bondi Sands self tanning face sleep mask or whatever. It's so good. I wake up looking like I've just come out of holiday. I think I've been talking about this before on my channel. I've had it for like a year now. Anyway, I'm going to bed for real, for real. Good night. <laughs> Morning! And then she said to myself that... Did I say this to myself that I wasn't drinking too much? Did I say that? I don't know if I said that. But here I am, hanging extremely bad, uh, with extremely dirty lashes. I thought I cleaned them last night. You guys didn't clean my lashes out last night. Anyway, I'm not going to bore you guys with my skincare because I feel like at this stage, if you don't already know what we put in the skincare, you just are not an OG, clearly. So we're going to skip through this part. Done. Okay, so I'm working from home again today. Which I thank God for because I feel so drunk. Not drunk, I just feel so like, yeah. I'll never understand. Oh, when I work from home, I love having um, like a podcast playing in the back. I don't know, I think that's my time where I get to listen to catch up on different podcast episodes or YouTube videos, but not YouTube videos that I need to like concentrate to. I like having YouTube videos that I can just kind of play in the background. So yeah, I'm listening to the Receipts podcast, which I was listening to yesterday. I'm just finishing off that episode. Uh, your Receipts foreplay makes me laugh. <laughs> the drunk thing but i'll be honest i do think sometimes when you're drunk you just had a recent breakup you weren't affection you probably Ooh, good morning even oh, i'm so tired good evening so i finished what today i literally i kid you not i pretty much slept throughout <laughs> I don't know, like, I'm feeling a lot better now. The hangover is definitely gone. But I just, I was hella tired. I can't lie, hella tired. But I've been craving, like, a really, really creamy, delicious pasta. So that's what I'm about to go and make. I'm also kind of in awe of my room. Like, even though, like, I have no wardrobe right now, like, this is just nothing. But I'm just in awe. I'm just deeping it. Like, all my clothes fit into one suitcase and two Ikea bags. Like, I think that's quite good. I think that's like not a lot. I don't know. Well, I do wardrobe clearance nearly every other week anyway, so yeah. Um, let's go and cook. I don't know how I'm gonna film this because my kitchen's a bit of a mess right now. So I'm gonna clean up and then I'm gonna cook because I hate filming in a dining room. Also, my phone case matches my jumper. I just feel like my life is together. I just feel like my life is together. And we're in the kitchen. Mine's hand. Sorry, it actually looks sick. Anyway. Better. All right, so we're gonna cook today. We're making, we're making, we're making like, I don't even know what we're making. I think I'm gonna kind of make it up, but I wanted to make like a creamy pasta kind of thing. Cause I was just, I don't know, I feel like when I go out drinking, I just crave like carbs. 
compared to all my friends, everything I say, whenever I, try, whenever I say I'm trying to lose weight, I'm lying. No, I'm not. So if I was really trying to lose weight, I wouldn't be making this much, like, carby food. But anyway, um, anyway, so I've been defrosting these Waitrose raw peeled jumbo king prawns all night i mean this afternoon and they look so good i for a long time i didn't know prawns were like white weird yeah so today at work it was the most embarrassing thing ever so i'm just like way too comfortable clearly i am like way too comfortable clearly so i was at work today and i was just on my call with my with one of my colleagues and we we're just talking, he's in Costa Rica, so you can basically he can basically just work from whatever he wants. Like his job is amazing. And I must have been so hungover that I burped really loud, didn't cut my mouth, I was just like eh. <laughs> really, really loud on camera, and yeah, it was so embarrassing. He was like, alright, Naya. I was like, do you know what? I'm just, I'm just way too comfortable here. Like there's just no yeah, there's no there's no professionalism anymore. That's all gone out the window. I feel like I'm starting to like, I love my job, but I, I need a change, you know? I'm at that point where I'm like, I need, I need a new challenge, I need a new direction, I need something different. You know, so um, yeah, that's what's happening right now. But let's get into cooking this. I kind of want to listen to like some music or a podcast or something. I was listening to Say Your Mind podcast actually, and I didn't get to finish it. It's an episode called Pussycat Dolls. She always has the most funniest names on her podcast, I swear to God. I think I put too much of the pasta water into the sauce. It was a bit watery. But other than that, the flavor is amazing. Mmm. I can't stop eating it. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go back to watching TV. Talk to you guys in a bit. Hi guys. So today is the next day. I had my dinner. And then I just went to bed, I was so tired. But anyway, today I'm still working from home, as per usual. I've, I have so many updates. So first of all, first update. Let me put you guys down whilst I work. So first update, oh, I look awful. God. Anyway, first update, my wardrobe company finally called me back and they were delivering my wardrobe by, so it's the end of the week and it's Thursday. I'm sure that should be like tomorrow but anyway they said that they're delivering it by the end of the week they called me last night and then on top of that i just got a call for my laser eye surgery appointment and i don't know they think they basically said that i can't have like lash extensions when i get it done but i did my googles and i don't see it i don't think it's a problem but that is what it is i am extremely exhausted i'm going out for lunch later on but i'm literally not gonna wear any makeup I'm just gonna put on a cute outfit and go but I think I'm gonna stay there and do the rest of my day from from that space because I got a lot to do and everyone's pissing me off. That's me done. I'm gonna get to work and I'll catch you guys when I'm about to go for lunch. Bye. For some reason, I have this random desire to listen to Caucasian pop music. Um, I'm over it now. I am so exhausted that I don't even know what to wear. I feel like just going in my tracksuit. Oh God. I'm just also. I don't know whether it's because I've booked my laser eye surgery, but I put on my old pair of glasses and I really like them. And I'm I'm kind of a bit like, do I really want to never wear glasses again? Like, do I re is that really is that really? I don't know. Okay, no, I want. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. Even if I need like a pair for reading, that's still cute. It just all the time. Yeah, no, no, it's not happening. It's still happening. I was just having a bit of a wobble. It's still happening. I literally grabbed the quickest thing I could find in my clusterfuck of a wardrobe. 
and throw it on because I genuinely can't be bothered. <laughs> can't be bothered. Cool. Alrighty, this is what we're working with today. All right, guys, let's get going. Good morning. Good morning, friends. Oh my god. So anyway, today I've decided I'm gonna take out my braids today. Like, I'm not sick of them. I'm not. I'm not sick of them. But the problem here is my mum decided that yesterday was the day she's gonna fry tomatoes whilst I was sat in the house working from home. And now my hair stinks. Like literally stinks and one thing i hate is hair that smells like i'm so sorry i can't i can't live my life like that so the braids are coming out today they're coming out today i'm not mad at these short braids though <laughs> but they just stink of fucking tomato and god tomato and onions like oh my god absolutely smell but anyway i'm gonna wear my bob so i'm basically gonna have short hair anyway it's just giving like intelligence it's giving a vibe. I'm not mad at that. Chow, I wish I was angry. I'm not mad at that. Why is this the hardest thing ever to cut? Alrighty, so I finally finished removing my braids. <laughs> took me, I don't even know what the time is. I actually don't care. It took me all morning to get rid of these braids and now I've finally got my wigs on. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna straighten it and make it look presentable. I actually don't have plans today, but I need to, I think I want to do self maintenance. Like, my room's really messy. Oh my God, this wardrobe stuff. <sighs> Stress, but it's fine. I just want to look a bit more presentable at home. That's the only reason why I put on my wig today. Um... I genuinely can't be bothered to do that, but it is what it is. Sup, baby, take me out to dinner. Alrighty, so I managed, <sighs> I managed to start this hair. Straightened it, styled it, cut some little edges, whatever. Made it look brand new, kind of, I guess. So I'm like, you know, I'm stepping out. I have a couple errands to run. I need to run to the shop, shit. Sure. I need to run to the shop and get these out these slugs fixed. And I also need to take some stuff to a charity shop as well. You guys know I love to give to charity. Ugh. So these are like stuff we've had in the attic because we cleared out our loft. Don't know why we did that, but anyway. So yeah, I need to take a couple things to the charity shops before they close. I'm just happy I did manage to do my hair because my hair is the bane of my existence. I swear to God. friends hello pretty went grocery shopping with very impromptu i still have all of the stuff i'm not sure charity shops are open right now but apparently i can like leave them outside the store so that's what i'm gonna do because i cannot drive around with this in my car for more than a certain amount of time like my car is so small that it is dragging on the ground dragging on the ground so yeah i'm gonna have to figure that out oh my god there's so much stuff Real love man, look for you, not Jackie Chan. My living room is an absolute pigsty, but my mum made gizdo dough. And I'm so happy. So I'm gonna have a good night. It's good my Saturday night with some giz, gizzard and plantain. Mmm, delightful. And I'm gonna watch some more Real Housewives because in this life I have nothing to do. Tomorrow we have a busy day though. Tomorrow's a busy day. We have. I'm going to the Museum of Nora in the morning and hopefully my builders are going to come and sort out my wardrobe 
They said they come between three and six, but honestly, because of that company is such a mess, I'm not holding them to any kind of time. When they get here, they get here, and then you know where my room is, and they can begin. But yeah, that's the plan right now. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, guys. Um, sorry, this, this robe is really sheer. So let's hope we don't get no nipple action. Anyway, um, cool. So today I am going, it's actually quite, well, it's not early for a Sunday, but I have feel like I've gotten up quite early today. I got up at like nine, <laughs> which to me is early for a Sunday because I like to sleep. I don't know what's been going on. I just love my sleep. But anyway, um, I'm meeting Roro today in Notting Hill. I think we're just gonna go for like some coffee and like a vibe. I see her like once a week. It's getting a bit ridiculous. But anyway, um, let's get this makeup on my face, girl. Get this makeup on my face. I am loving the wig life, but then this is how, this is what I'm like. I will like the wig life for a couple days and I'm like, yeah, I'm, I can't do this anymore. <laughs> the maintenance. I'm just not used to so much maintenance. I like waking up and looking the exact same as when I went to bed. Something about waking up with gel wear cane roads just doesn't sit right in my soul, but that's fine. <laughs> West, West, I assume. Best song. Best song. Ugh, I love the return of JoJo. Anyway, I'm ready. My, my face is ready. My camera died as I was getting ready, so I had to charge it. So, sorry. You didn't get to see me do this. But, um, it's the same as every other vlog, so you didn't really miss out on much, if I'm very honest. Apart from the fact that my makeup brushes were clean. Today. Did he even give me a fucking spoon? Well then, that's awkward. This is why I hate taking photos of places that are um, streets. Mind. Guess what? Like, this is just real life. This is people do this now. This is actually people's jobs. Yeah, 100%. So they have to just accept it. Oh, this is fresh. Yeah. This is fresh. It's fresh mint. I love that. Yum. Oh, it's like a nice warm hug. Mm. That's what I needed. Ooh, I love me some mint tea. And I've got water because she's basic and on keto. Can you not drink tea because you're not because yeah, you're on keto? I, I can drink tea on keto. I just don't oh. drink tea. Oh, okay. <laughs> You want to talk about keto just needs a minimum amount of carbs. You could eat everything else. Oh, fun. I love carbs. This is the problem. Carbs give me a fat ass. <laughs> <laughs> Period. Cheeky chill day. Doing one of our favorite things. Drinking outside and taking photos. That's all we do. Cheers. Chin chin. Bing. Love that. Guys, it's perfect! Oh my god, this is so worth it. It even looks it sick on the camera. It does. Oh my god, this was worth it. This was worth it. This is All the about, stress. This is <laughs> <laughs> no, we should have one more crying. Let's pretend to cry. <laughs> the white off fingers, yeah. Pretend to cry. <laughs> Put your back in it. Put your back in it. Just a little more. Just. A <laughs> oh okay. my god! I can't believe it. Basically, there's meant to be two lights, but one oh. of them is broken. How? So I don't know. So they're gonna send me a second one. So I'm gonna have. 
basically one here and one there yeah one here one there now yeah for now i mean <laughs> Do you know what I mean? I just love it. I love it. I absolutely love it. I can't it. stop saying it myself. Like, you have a choice. <laughs> <laughs> no, but. Oh my god, it's been weeks. I need to face out everybody. I, just, I feel like I've accomplished something because this has been the one thing that I've been complaining about you for have, ages. You have, you have. I need a fucking wardrobe. I can't live like this. I was living like a squatter. Like, if a you see squatter. her stuff outside. <laughs> no, they've seen it. I showed them, I was like, right. I'm It's ridiculous. The life I'm living right now, it's not the life for me. No, I need to really get with it because I be staring at myself in the viewfinder. I do this all it's, the time. it's the camera I should be staring at. I do it all the time. I need to call everybody. Just because it's a moment. It's just a moment. Oh, she's probably at um, Michael's house. This is so the baby. This is so cute. It's just everything. Put your back in it. I'm so very close to the baby entire time. I'm gonna call everyone. <laughs> <laughs> it's the fact that. You know, oh my gosh, you haven't answered the damn phone. You know, so I have to answer at this point. I just hang up. I need someone just to, to be in this moment with I'm me. I'm here. Like normally because of the your speaker way. you have a speaker there no my speaker's under my desk oh okay once i'm able you to put all my clothes and everything in the wardrobe you decide where then goes. i can clear up everything else everything else has been chaos and a mess but i think this is because so this is so cute it's so good right i love her i'm Why? gonna wake up smiling every day yeah you will here you go is it recording yeah it's been recorded this entire time oh. Chin chin. Cheers. To the new wardrobe. Ah! Let's see the new wardrobe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was so dark. No, I could just hug it. Like, oh, all my stuff in here. I need to sweep the floor. There's like screws and shit on the floor. What kind of mess what does this guy make? Is he all right? That's what no, she's not man. safe. What the heck? No, she's safe. Danger. That's what she's not safe. Yeah, right, yeah, let me show you guys the inside of the wardrobe. So. The wardrobe, um. Empty wardrobe Yeah, tour. so they can see <laughs> empty wardrobe tour. They can see what it looks like. So in, oh, okay. Let me hold it open. Doesn't want to stay open. It's fine. Okay, one side. Did you put it? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I took my back. Okay, so on one side we have, anyway, so shelves. So shelving, it has approximately one, two, three, four, and the fit. Does that count? <laughs> Don't know, wait. One, one two, two, three, three four, four, five. It has five. The five sections. shelving spaces. Yeah. Yeah. I'm thinking handbags. So they are quite deep. Quite like deep. my whole hand can fit in it. Yeah. Yeah, it's quite deep. I'm thinking handbags at the top, maybe some shoes at the, the bottom, bottom, and then clothes in the middle yeah. too. Yeah, fantastic. Yeah, makes sense. Cool. And then on this side, we have more shelving space I at think the top. Bags, can go here. bags up there. That yeah. would make more sense. And then obviously you can put some two hanging well. umbrellas. Oh. And then like jackets and like pieces. Like I don't really put large. jackets in here because of I put in the main house because then no space. Dresses and two pieces. Yes, I can just hang things. I could just put clothes away. I can see my clothes. Oh my god, I love this life. Why are there these random screws though? Like surely you should have used them. Um, no, sometimes they give you extras. Okay. Shocked that he would just leave them on the floor there. It's really scary. Right, time me to put my clothes back in because of they're outside. <laughs> Yeah, let's go because it's actually outside in the garden. And at least now I can like organize it. Yeah. Like organize my your space. Yeah, like my clothes and stuff. But do you what do you need anything right now? Yeah, I'm just gonna bring your help you bring your stuff in. Oh thank you, babe. Well who's gonna help who else is gonna help you? <laughs> okay. We're not wanting to pick up the phone. Oh phone well ringing. let's call you back. Hold on one second. I love her. I love her. She's so good. 
big. She's so big. Look at all this space. Oh, look at all this space. Oh, I can't stop smiling. Denim jackets. Yeah, I think she's. And we'll have progress. Thanks, thanks to Millie. Shout out to you for helping me because it's not gonna make sense right now, but I just need it gone out of the way. Don't watch the swag. I just threw clothes on because I was tired. I'm so tired. I've been doing this for the past three hours. It's been three hours on this wardrobe. It's not a joke. It's your life. And we're done. We are done. I'm not gonna show you inside because it's actually awful. <laughs> it's not bad. It's not good. It. It's not cute. It's you not like organized. It. It's it's cut. It's getting there. We're just it's, tired. I'm just really tired. But the trousers look alright. The shoes don't look bad. Well, they don't look that bad. Yeah, I mean, they could look bad. <laughs> anyway, yeah, that's that. This is this side. Honestly, I like the jackets area, which is that yeah, part. It's yeah, and it's like a nice, like dark, light, gradient. little gradient vibe. Anyway, I can now do this. I don't know why this is just, this is, this is just a vibe. The only thing is just keeping this mirror clean, but. Well, you could do that. I can easily, but I, I don't even keep my smaller mirrors clean, let alone this one, but anyway, it's fine. I can. Manage it. I can wipe it down. I will call you once a week to ask you to clean it. Have you mirror. cleaned your mirror? But anyway, yeah, thank you guys for watching this vlog. It's been very chaotic. Every day is on a journey, and we finally have a wardrobe. Bye, vlog. <laughs> I'm so happy. Bye, guys.